Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm back with another video. So we got uh, the Logan trailer two, and or the final trailer, or, how, or however you want to call it. This trailer was probably just as equal to the first trailer with regards as excitement. Um, I like that the fact that we got to see more X twenty three, because at first I was like, eh, they're seeing. I, I like that. I like that they're showing Logan. But I also want to see more X-23, or Laura, as I like to call her. A lot of people are saying, uh, when they're talking about it, oh, she's a clone, she's in this and that. I don't really consider her a clone, per se, because, because you know, that if you read the comics or if you heard about the comics, you know that there was a woman who gave birth to Laura because of the X and Y chromosomes and, you know, science. You know, so I don't, I consider her his daughter, not his clone. So I just want to get that out of the way so that we can move on. So I consider him, I consider her his daughter, not, not his, cl not the clone. So yeah. Anyway, um, I like that we got to see more of her. Now, if you watch the green band trailer and if you watch the red band trailer, eh, they're not much difference except the reactions or I guess from Logan and Xavier about what they think about, you know, X-23 ripping dudes up. But, uh, yeah, there's not much difference because you still will see the blood ripping through and and you'll see, there's, this movie is going to have comic book level, comic book style, like gore ripping out and s stuff like that. It's just, it's going to be really good. Um, and then that scene where she's just like, she just slices that one dude's throat as like the big opener. Oh, that was pretty cool. Like, I, I like that. I like that a lot. Um, I also liked that they, that they put an X-Men man, man, X comic in there. Uh, it was really, that was really good. It was kind of like a little cameo for Wolverine or in the yellow costume or something. I don't know. Uh, my, brother actually, my brother actually had a theory that... Uh, We'll get a flashback or something with him wearing the yellow suit. I don't know. That would be cool, but who knows? We might we might not get flashbacks. Probably be good not to get flashbacks. Maybe at the beginning. Maybe. Maybe I don't know. But um, yeah. I mean, there's not really much else to talk about. I mean, you know, it just shows uh, Wolverine kind of becoming more of a father figure to this girl because it's their dad. So you know. That's what I like. I like that. I like that, that little father-daughter relationship going on with this. A lot of people keep comparing this to The Last of Us. Yeah, I know. I get it. It reminds people of that game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Ha, ha, ha. Very funny. It's like someone just kind of like took a, you know, took some, had, had the director was like, I got a great, I, pl I just played this awesome game called The Last of Us. I got a great idea. <laughs> so... So anyway, guys, um, that's my little little uh, thoughts about what I think about this. Um, I don't really have a lot of speculation in this video. Uh, not much else I can say about the video about the um, about this. Other than that, then I think uh, I don't know if I said this in the original video, but I I, I theorized that Xavier's gonna die. He's going to die. Uh, spoiler alert, if I'm right. Uh, sorry about that, but he's going to die. He's going to die. He's too old. They're going to do it, and then they're going to kill Logan. That's my theory, though. I think that's the best option they can do, maybe, um, if, if he really is not going to play Wolverine no more. Um, I don't know. We'll see, but... Um, Anyway, guys, uh, thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the notification button or the little bell if you haven't already. And um, yeah, yeah, don't. F and uh, I'm out of here. Uh, up, up, and away. See you guys.